God. Oh my God, guys. Welcome to today's video in which we're going to be solving system of equations by the method of substitution. So you're going to be given a system of equations once again um, with two variables that you want to find these answers to. And then what you're going to do is that you're going to use the method of substitution in order to solve it. Right. So let's begin, guys. The first thing we have to take into account are basic steps that we're going to follow whenever we are solving a system of equations by substitution. Right. Um, the first thing that you have to do is that you're going to solve for X or for Y. You are the one that is going to choose that um, on one of the two equations. Again, you choose the equation and you choose if you want to solve for X or Y. The important thing is that you're going to isolate that variable. Right. And after you do that, you're going to substitute that that value you found on the other equation. And then you're going to get the, your first value. After you get your first value, you're going to substitute once again back on the first equation that you found. And you're going to get your second value. Right. So again, the first thing is that we're going to choose one of the two equations and we're going to choose if we want to solve for X or for Y. OK, so again, you can choose whatever you want. I'm going to choose the second one. And I'm going to choose Y. Right. So I want to solve for Y on the second one. Right. So I have 2X plus Y is equal to 17. Right. So that means that if I want to solve for Y, Y is equal to 17 minus 2X. Because 2X is multiplying, sorry, is adding, so I pass it subtracting. Right. That's it. Now, what we do is that we're going to, again, the second step is to substitute that variable in the other equation that you didn't use. So we're going to go on that first equation that I didn't use. And we had 3x plus 4y is equal to 33. And I'm going to substitute this value of y. So it's going to be 3x plus 4. And now we're going to substitute y, which is 17 minus 2x, and that is equal to 33, right? And now we're just going to solve the equation there. So we have 3x, and then we have 4 times um, 17, right? We're going to do that, and that is going to give us a value of 68. And then 4 times minus 2, remember that you have to multiply both. So 4 times minus 2 is minus 8x, and that is equal to 33. Now we're just going to solve this. So this is the 8. I'm going to move it to the right. So it's 3x minus 8x is equal to 33 minus 68. So it's going to be minus 5x, right, is equal to 33 minus 68, which is going to be minus 35 right and x since the minus 5 is um multiplying it's going to divide so minus 35 divided by minus 5 which is going to be positive 7 and there we have the first value so that means that for this system of equation x is equal to 7. now that we have found x we can go back to our first equation and we have y is equal to 17 minus 2 times 7 right so we're gonna get y is equal to 17 minus 2 times 7 is 14 so y is equal to 17 minus 14 which is going to be 3. so that means that for this system of equations x is equal to 7 and y is equal to 3. and that is pretty much it for today guys so i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys Check out these other videos to improve your math skills and make sure you click that subscribe button to make the community grow. Follow Omath God in its social media accounts, drop a like, a comment below, and see you on the next one. Bye!